Hello everyone. In this video, we are going to talk about blood relations. The questions asked in this section depend upon our day-to-day -day real life relations. In order to solve them, you must have pretty good knowledge of blood relations. So, before solving any question, you must learn this table by heart. This table denotes the relationships from the paternal side. In the next table, we have relations from the maternal side. The question asked in UGC net are mostly based on the relationships given in these two tables. So before going any further, I would suggest you to go through all the blood relations given in this table and learn them thoroughly. Couple of more points. Children of same parents are also known as siblings and spouse which means partner can also refer to both husband as well as wife. Now let's discuss the approach for solving the questions with minimum effort. The most common and widely used method is family relationship tree. It is a graphical representation of people and their relationship among themselves. Here we use arrows, plus, minus and other such symbols to convey our message graphically. In this video, we are going to use plus as a symbol for male and minus as a symbol for female. Equal to symbol represents marriage. This double arrow symbol denotes that A and B are siblings. And to denote that A is the child of B, we use this downward arrow symbol. So suppose A has two children, B and C. Then we can denote it in this manner here. Now comes the question of drawing the family relationship tree. First, read the question carefully and then try to identify the males and the females. Then use the above given info notations here or if you prefer your own notation, then use them to draw the people and corresponding relationships and then answer the question. Let us see this with an example. Suppose A is the sister of B. C is the son of D and A is the wife of D. We need to find out how B and C are related to each other. Given that B is a male. So let's solve this question piece by piece. A is the sister of B. So A is a female. Hence minus sign here. And this double arrow denoting the sibling relationship. C is the son of D. So here, C is a male and so the plus sign here. Downward arrow represents C is a child of D. Next, A is the wife of D. Therefore, D is the husband of A and hence he is a male. And the positive equal to sign uh, denotes their marriage. Now in the question, it's given to us that B is a male. Our job is to group all these information together and find out how B and C are related to each other. So, on joining all the pieces together, we get this diagram, which is a family relationship tree. Now, D is the father of C and D is also married to A. Hence, A is the mother of C. B is the brother of A. Therefore, D is the maternal uncle of C. So here is our answer. Coming to the last example, let E be the son of A, D is the son of B, and E is married to C. C is given as the daughter of B. Then how is D related to E? Now given E is the son of A, E is a male. Same goes with D. Who is the son of B? And now, since E is married to C, hence she is a female and here daughter of B. So, this is how the family tree would look like. Now, if we talk about E, then D is the brother of his wife. Therefore, D will be his brother-in-law. In UGC net, similar questions are asked from this portion. All you need to do is remember all the relations, make correct family trees and then simply answer the question.
that's it for today hope you liked it